You could say this is a mini envelope opening. What's inside the minifig's monthly subscription box? Not one of my best? Producers are saying, no, it's no, it's not one of your best. Minifigs Monthly, every single month, delivers to you a selection of exactly what you think this would be. Minifigs, specifically Lego minifigures, are delivered to your house every single month in this really cool foiled sort of chromium envelope. As you can also see too, it's not been made by futuristic bees. Could you imagine futuristic bees? I'm getting ahead of myself. Uh, it is packed as with this being a pillow envelope and a pillow cushion envelope means whatever inside is getting quite protected. Uh, it has served what purpose it needed to do to get to point A or from point A to point B and point B in my house. So I'm going to go ahead and get this opened up. Now I suppose I could have used a knife, but I'm feeling barbaric today. Feeling as if I want to just rip off, just rip off a dry jump, drumstick and just eat it. Just nibble away at it. I'm going to go ahead and pull out all the contents. That'd probably be a lot easier than pulling out one at a time. And let's see what we got inside. Your minifigs have arrived from Minifigs Monthly. Whether you are a Lego fanatic, casual fan, or AFOL, adult fan of Lego, we hope you enjoy this month's minifig packs. Joy waits. Check us over at social media by minifigsmonthly at gmail.com, minifigs-monthly.cratejoy.com. We're aware... Oh, where can you subscribe to the Minifigs Monthly? It's right there. Minifigs-monthly.cratejoy.com. Gotcha. Okay. I'm starting to see a lot of Batman-themed characters here. That's right up my alley. Also got myself a sticker, so I can put that in my sticker album. My very large, growing sticker album. Maybe it's not, maybe it's not growing that much. The first thing we're going to have a look at is Batman. Now, on the back sides of these, one thing that helps is it tells you exactly which series it's from, what character name. So the first one is Minifig 1, Minifig Type Batman, theme, the Lego Batman movie, and the accessory that comes included with it is a Batarang. Further investigating what points were made on the back of the envelope here. Here we go. We got ourselves Batman. Lego movie Batman, to be exact. I always love the fact that the new Batman Lego movies have a three-dimensional uh, utility belts as opposed to them being printed on. Am I the only one that likes that? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, there is front printing. There is back printing. It's certainly on its head, depending on which, which, which style you like for your Cape Crusader. There's that one. And then there's that one. And then there's that one again. And then there's that one again. This is what the back printing looks like. I like that they use these softer capes rather than those really rigid ones that they used to use back in the day. For his accessories, he comes with not one, but two. A staple, it seems, for Lego. They always seem to give you two Batarangs. Even when you get vehicles that come with Batarangs, Batarangs are always the thing they throw extras in. I have to have probably about 700. All right, I'm exaggerating. It's more like 825 Batarangs kicking around in totes. I'm going to add two more to the mix. I probably put these the wrong way. That's, there we go. Put them into Batman's clamped hands. The folks over at Minifigs Monthly also know that I love my Lego hands turned up rather than turned sideways. I'm already happy with that. So we got Batman. Let's go in proper sequence. That's Minifig 4. That's Minifig 3. This is Minifig 2. Minifig type is Magpie. Lego theme was the Lego Batman movie, and the accessory is TNT. I never did acquire Magpie when collecting the Batman minifigs. I sort of really struck out when I think when it comes to getting those minifigs. I wanted things like Clock King and Egghead. I think Egghead was one of them. Clock King, I know it was. I wanted to get a Clock King. I never got a chance to. So I'm thinking this goes this way. There you go. And there's Magpie. I don't know if she's got back head printing. Oh, she does. Oh, she does. Let's turn the head around if I can get in there with my fingers. There we go. And we'll put the head back, the hair piece back on. I like that head sculpt, that hair piece, head piece. You know what I mean. We're going to put a couple of sticks of TNT in there. There's one. And like Batman's Batarangs, she comes with two. Like one wasn't destructive enough. You get two. 
two of them. I'll add that to Batman. Minifig 3, this one is Calendar Man uh, theme, the Lego Batman movie once again. Accessory sadly has none. But I guess the saving grace in this is even though he doesn't have any accessories, he comes with a really neat looking cape. Let me just show you. Let me just show you what I'm talking about. Now this is sort of more the traditional Batman or the traditional capes that they use for these minifigs. They seem to be a little bit more difficult to put in place. Thank goodness Minifigs Monthly did all the work for me because I would have had just a nightmare experience trying to get all that cape put together, folded over one another, and then quickly putting the head over top of that. Does he have any back printing? No, he does not. Thank goodness for that. So there's the Calendar Man. Never got this one before. I can add that to my Lego Minifig collection. And last but certainly not least, I just, oh, I gave it away. You guys probably already knew anyways. You guys are really smart viewers. Minifig 4, Minifig type is Catwoman. Theme is the Batman Lego movie or Lego Batman movie. And the accessory is a whip. A pink colored Catwoman, which I'm trying to think if actually I had gotten already. I know I had gotten there. There was a set that had Batman's, I think Catwoman had a cycle. Batman had kind of like a, like a bat pod. I feel it's almost as if that was the same Catwoman. Although, you know what? Now that I'm looking at it, I don't remember. I don't recall the utility belt sticking out like this. So maybe I'm thinking of something else. I I think about other stuff all the time. There's what the head looks like. There was the... Oh, look at this head sculpt. I'm going to go with this one. Sorry, closed mouth. But I was won over by the slightly open smiling mouth, if you want to consider that. I love the cowl on it. I love how the goggles stick out the way that they do and the icing on the cake. Delicious, sweet frosting. Uh, we can put the whip into her hand. It's slightly more of a softer plastic. And there is Catwoman. A nice little setup. It's almost as if Minifigs Monthly knew exactly the type of minifigs that I'm into. I'm all about the Batman minifigs. And we got ourselves some pretty cool ones. We've got, of course, Catwoman, Batman. Calendar Man. Can I see? Can I hold all of these? Maybe not. I don't know. And Magpie with dynamite. So these guys will probably be standing over here. If you guys are interested in subscribing to the Minifigs Monthly, it's simply a case, once again, of going over to their website at www.minifigs-monthly.cratejoy.com. A lot of dashes, a lot of dots. But either way, that is the map that will lead you to Promised Land. If promised land for you is minifigs every single month like i said minifigs will deliver right to your door for usually it's a case of four minifigs right to your door joy awaits joy certainly certainly awaits i was going to say doesn't wait any further for me because now i got the one for this month but i guess joy awaits the next month as we open up another minifigs monthly speaking of subscribing to the minifigs monthly if you, your friends, you, sir, your friends, or maybe the ne next door neighbor's kids, if you guys haven't subscribed yet to this channel, hit that little subscribe button that's just down below. Why not just walk down the street and yell? If you guys haven't reviewed, or if you guys have not subscribed to the review spot just yet, make sure you hit that little subscribe button down below. People will be opening up their doors saying, who, who is this guy talking about? What little subscribe button? Honey, did you order a little subscribe button? No, I didn't. That's usually how we would go. Uh, more videos like this, guys, will be coming away. We're going to be doing some unboxings of other fun stuff, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.